Crush the Castle 2, a very interesting Flash game on Mind Jolt. Very interesting game about medieval warfare. I played this game for quite a while, and this is the first time I'm actually doing a review about it. And the entire thing, the entire premise of this game is very simple. Just knock down the enemy's castle with a trebuchet. For those of us who don't know what a trebuchet is, a trebuchet is a medieval weapon designed to throw rocks at buildings and stuff, like castles. Ooh, I got something new. Alright. During the gameplay, you get all sorts of awesome methods of attack. You start off with, like, blocks of wood, then you move up to rocks, then you move up to bombs. And then, where I'm at in the game right now, you get elemental-based attacks. And apparently, this wizard here has enabled me to obtain some form of electrical attack. And that right there, ladies and gentlemen where the mouse is going, where the pointer is, that's the trebuchet. A trebuchet was, like I said before, a medieval weapon which existed before the, the advent of cannons. And the purpose of it was, like I said, to knock down medieval, medieval fortresses, castles, and what have you. And the weapons you use vary. You start off with like some, a simple block of wood. There it is right there. Then you get three blocks of wood, then you get boulders, and then steel boulders, and you keep going up to more powerful weaponry. I'm going to use these bombs right here to knock down this castle right here. Looks like there's a wizard over there. And as you can tell, it did not necessarily do well. But doesn't mean that it's the end of the world, per se. In fact, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use a fire base attack, and I'm going to throw it, and... Ooh! Look at that right there. And you get all sorts of achievements from this game, um, like, based on what you do, like, in this case, Pyrotechnic, you destroy the entire castle or whatever with, um with fire and as you can tell it's on fire right now it's just burning up and that damn wizard he's just standing there amidst the burning building and he's not doing a damn thing meanwhile the castle just burns up and what have you and he's just gonna stand there and it's just gonna burn okay it's all gonna burn and ah uh, there it went now then, looks like this wizard here is just going to stand there. Now, if you mess up, you can always click down here to the reset button, and it restores the castle as is. Um, that way, in the event you mess up or something, you can try again. This time, I'm gonna use some. This time, I'm going to use some some of the stone rocks I told you about. And I'm going to try the fire attack again, see if I can do better. Now, aw, oh, damn. Well, anyways, what you do is you have to knock down this castle. Now let's see if I can do it again. Hopefully the fire can circle around this wizard. And, ooh, ooh, it's this time. This is, it, it's doing what I want it to do. Now let's just sit back and let the fires do its work in destroying the castle. As you can tell, the wizard is obviously oblivious to the fact that the entire castle he's in is on fire. Is he using some sort of magic sphere to keep him from burning alive? I don't know. What I do know is this wizard is eventually going to burn, one way or another. And, uh-oh. Uh-oh, this wizard might be meeting his end. And we can tell right now. Oh. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Let's see what happens. Um, Just watch it burn and break apart. And he's gonna... Ooh! 
Now, if you kill or destroy a castle or kill its entire inhabitants in one go, in like one or two shots, you get a gold medal and you unlock like a super weapon that is like out of this world. I'm not going to say what it is exactly because I don't want to ruin it per se, but it is a pretty good weapon. And this is another castle, you know, you throw it right there and it just, you know... It mainly depends on the timing of the trebuchet, and you don't necessarily have to kill it all in one shot. You just, you know, just throw it repeatedly and everything like that, you know, and it's a pretty interesting game right here. It takes a while to master, but not too long to master it, if you know what I'm saying, because... Whoa! Now that's what you call an electric boogaloo. And I got another gold medal. And now I've got more castles to destroy. And so far what happens is you can circle around like the eagle or bird or whatever it is represents like where you've been and indicates lands you've conquered. And if you listen closely, you can hear that medieval music and check out the achievements you've got. Like, I've unlocked some, as you can see here. And, like, there's one that says, over here, I'm a lumberjack, destroy ten castles with log ammunition only, air burst, death from above, log to death, a freeze is coming, acidic, and all this sort of stuff. Now, if you really want to get the most out of it, you just check out this right here, and you can even unlock all the projectiles so you don't have to worry about playing through and unlocking them that way. But I prefer playing through it and unlocking them because it's much more fun that way. Because if you use the special attack all the time, then it just gets boring. And then you get additional castles to destroy just for fun. And there's another one I've yet to do, which is called the cheat mode. And then, or you can just get them all in one go. Um, I'll just put it, I'll just put a link down in the video below, down in the comments below. And I'll let you decide, you know. You can tell I've played this game a couple of times. It's the, actually the sequel to, um to crush the castle but a good way of describing this game is it's Angry Birds meets Medieval Warfare now on a scale from 1 to 5 5 being the best and 1 being absolute crap this one automatically gets a 5 so I'm gonna leave a link for you to play it go over and play it because it's a very great game and you'll have good enjoyment destroying castles so best of luck in destroying castles and until then this video is done comment rate whatever you want to do entirely up to you link share comment subscribe have a nice day.